Hello everyone, it's Randy here again. Another episode of Farm and Simulator 2013. And we are playing on the Munich Winkle map. We are playing with a more realistic game engine, the damage mod and the forest mod. And we are finishing up here the sunflower harvest we uh, started on after, or, yeah, after the game crashed here uh, last episode. Uh, because of the crash, we kind of went and did something else, and I just let this uh, set. So yeah, we're now back at the uh, sunflowers here. Hopefully we will uh, finish this up without any incidents. Uh, so first things first, got to put this uh, corn header away. I call it corn. Yeah, I guess we uh, used it for sunflowers too, so... Uh, row crop header maybe would be more appropriate, I guess. And I'm hoping this will fit on this trailer here. I'm not sure. I've never tried this. Let's see what's here. Do I gotta come at it from the other way? Take a quick look at this here a minute. That's interesting. Ah, uh, yes, I gotta come at it from the other side. Okay. Uh, still se experiencing severe lag on this map, but I've still not been able to figure out why, so... You know, the part that uh, confuses me is the fact that I haven't changed anything, and it suddenly started lagging, so... Which would almost uh, suggest something with a map, but... Like I said, if I sell all my mods and it runs a nice steady 60 frames a second, no problemo. Which is kind of weird. Actually, I don't even have to sell all my mods. I just have to actually sell most of my modded mods. And disconnect. Oh, no. Actually, I wonder if I should fold that up. Uh, I think this one... Yes, yeah, so this one folds up. There we go. Now we can transport it down the road. Anyway, yeah, like I was saying, if I sell all my mods that I currently own, <laughs> then the game is fine, so... I find it hard to believe that every single one of my mods is causing an issue here. Now, I don't doubt this combine probably don't help, but still. Something I was looking at, too, when I just uh, logged into the game here. So I was looking at the sky, like, I wonder if something uh, with that has anything to do with it. Maybe some weather going on? I wonder if that's causing issues. I have no idea, but I'm just, you know, kind of looking around at other stuff. See if I can, you know, figure out what's going on here. Oh, we can go fast down the hill. My wheat header should be parked over here somewhere. Dropped it off in the, uh, along the trees here. Find out exactly where I left it here now. Well, there's a tractor hiding back there. I don't think that's where I left it. I think it wandered over there by itself. Just a guess, but... Ah, yes, there's our... header. Okay, there we go. And I wonder what field shall we do first here. Yeah, maybe we'll uh, start on the big one, the one next to our sunflower field there. Maybe we'll do that one first. I was thinking about uh, doing the one on the farm here first, but we're having a lot of troubles down here, so... Go somewhere where there's not so much problem. At least hopefully there won't be so much problem anyway.
And if I recall correctly, it was a wheat on this field and then the one on the farm there as well, so... Definitely should be getting a lot more uh, product off of this uh, field than we, than we were the sunflower field. Yeah, we definitely did not get much in the way of sunflowers off that field. I was kind of surprised. I thought it would be a lot uh, higher volume, but... Guess not, so... Okay, I think I can hire a regular hired worker on this field. Again, I think these trees here are all clipped through a wolf, so... Okay, there we go. Okay, first things first, let's uh, uh, empty our overloader. Okay. Okay, we got the weights. Um, all wheel drive, yep. Where's my tires? Thought that was seven and eight. Okay, that's kind of weird. Oh, I should mention too, I do, I do have uh, course play working again. Um, I'm not entirely sure what went wrong with it. I re-added the mod to the folder. That did not help or work. Also restarted the computer just to see if that would uh, fix anything. That was, again, a negative. Uh, so I went ahead and deleted out the uh, key binding uh, file, XML file, inside of the farming sim folder. That might be why my uh, tires aren't working, maybe? I don't know. That seems to work. Yeah, no double tires. Well, that's a bummer. Anyhow, anyway, uh, deleting out that key binding XML seems to have fixed the uh, problem with course play opening. That looks like it may have caused other issues now, though. I wonder if there's anything else that uh, doesn't quite work. It's kind of a bummer, because I think this tractor looks really weird without uh, duels, duels on. Yeah, the front weight works, but no tires. Oh, well. Yeah, no unload animation, as you can see. Probably something to do with the sunflowers, if I had to guess. Oh, no, interesting enough, this looks like it's uh, probably wheat in here, but this one looks like canola texture. I'm not sure if it randomly chooses the textures for it. I have no idea how that works. Anyway, we'll head over to where our combine is. Speaking of combine, how's he doing? 40%. Wow, that's it. I thought he'd be fuller than that. Of course, he probably is going slower on the wheat here than he was the sunflowers. So that was my experience anyway. And go faster. I could go faster with the sunflowers here than I could with wheat. Or actually, what was that barley? Yeah, barley. I had to go slower with the barley. I would assume the wheat would be the same way. I would assume. Uh, no straw. You know what? I guess we can keep that way. I don't think we really need straw, so we'll leave it that way. Now, course play for this. Oh, boy. We drive through these trees here. Uh, 
Ah, we can. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. I want to come from the other side, ain't I? Okay. I think it's not with the wheels on these tires. Uh, let's set up a course play course then for unloading this combine, and I'll set it up as an overload course. Probably park that uh, truck along this tree line here somewhere. Okay. Looks like a good start point to me. wait point there. I know I don't have the truck here yet, but once we do, I'll have to make sure I uh, run this course somehow or something so I get the truck in the right spot. Okay, stop the course there. And this is field 47. Oh good, I got a field 47 folder already. So field 47 overload tractor that in the correct folder before I forget. Oh. Okay, looks like everything's set and dry, of course. Oh, apparently he thinks he needs to unload the combine already. Okay. That's fine. Still no double tires. Interesting. Unless my memory mistakes me, I'm pretty sure it was uh, 7 and 8. Uh, there's 6 for the uh, headlights. Kind of weird that, uh, you know, like the headlights would work. Or headlights. Actually, this would be the rear lights. Rear work lights, probably. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, that's interesting. <laughs> uh, 1, 2, and 3. Do it now. Okay. Okay, very interesting. I'm going to have to go back and look at that mod. Now that I think about that, I might have changed that on this tractor. Well, anyway, now we got double tires. It's one, two, and three. Now that means that we got our four ways on. Oh, boy. Yeah, I can put those out, too, now that we got the dual tires on. We're on the uh, field, so we definitely don't need that. But, uh, you yeah, know, that looks weird. Okay, let's grab this truck here, and we're going to sell some sunflowers. Hopefully, anyway. I know we looked last episode where to sell them at. I don't recall where that was now. So, 10, 15, 18. So, at the mill. we got to figure out where the mill is at. Okay, I think this is the uh, unofficial shortcut here. We'll put on brakes. Okay, let's see. So which one of these is sunflowers here? I'm guessing the one on the end. I guess I can always drive under it, and uh, if it doesn't unload, that's the one, but... Yeah, sun and bloomin'. <laughs> sun and bloomin', okay. That's probably sunflowers. Just a guess. Uh, it's definitely not English, I know that much. Uh, probably German, if I had to guess. Uh, 
Okay, it's Delphi Sunflowers. It's filling up. So let's see what's here. Looking at my map here I have in front of me. Where would the mill be? Yeah, top corner where I suspect it looks like. Yep, mill, top corner. Okay, so we're going to the very top corner of the map there. Um, that is up here, that is. It's probably the mill right there. Yeah, my plan for the lag is probably going to be just to start moving uh, vehicles out of this area here. Kind of spread them out the map a little bit. It's really the only thing I can think of to do at the moment. Like I said, I've, I've spent a significant amount of time here trying to figure out what uh, is causing the lag. And so far, no luck. I certainly have not been able to uh, narrow it down to any one particular vehicle. Okay, I think we gotta go this way if I remember correctly. Probably should have created a course play course for this. I was gonna be making this trip a lot. Uh, wonder, should we wait to sell it? I'm thinking not. Not sure if that uh, matters quite so much now with the moralistic condition. I don't think the prices fluctuate quite as badly as they did with the non-MR. That is always something that kind of annoyed me about farming sim, how fast the prices just bottomed out. I mean, come on now, that's kind of uh, ridiculous if you ask me. Oh, coming up a nice hill there. Yeah, as you can see, uh, this trailer handles much better with this trailer. Or this, yeah, this trailer handles much better with this truck. We get it right here yet. Yeah, it's not all tipping over and flopping around like it was with the uh, Volvo truck there. Yeah, this is an MR truck, and we're passing this guy. Oh crap! Another car coming in the other lane. Yeah, I can definitely tell uh, MR truck makes a big difference with this uh, trailer. I think uh, before we couldn't even make a, what, 10 mile an hour turn without tipping over, over hardly. I mean, now we're taking them over, what, about 40 mile an hour. Now it occurs to me I might want to look at my map, make sure I'm heading in the right direction, but I'm pretty sure I am. I know the steering does catch me off guard every now and then. It's it's definitely, I don't slow the right word for it. It's not as responsive as you normally is. You know, without the MR version, the steering's quite responsive and, you know, and it's turning. Whereas MR here it definitely slows down quite a bit. Got a little more of a fluid feel to it, I would say. Now, let's see what's here. We're going to have to turn off here somewhere, I believe. Well, it's not too bad. It's the first time I looked at my map, so. Uh, is that one the mill? Yes, I believe it is. Okay, 
we'll just get driving on that. I'm not sure if it proves anything to drive on that or not, but make a nice wider turn here. And I'm assuming this is where we have to go. I'm just out of curiosity. I want to check this a minute. I see there's something else over here. This isn't anything, is it? It's just a back wall, or... Oh, well, this is a dump point as well. Okay. Oh, it's one over here, too. Begs the question, what are they? Oh, it looks like there's something back here, too, maybe. Okay. I'm guessing you could probably buy something there if I had to guess. Actually, does it show anything? Uh, it doesn't. Okay. Anyway, I'll assume this is the correct spot here. And what do we have for sunflowers in stock? Oh, 173, so a good three trips. Oh yeah, that's making us some nice money there. About time something makes us some uh, nice money. Yeah, so far the only thing that's really made us money is actually our logging enterprises. Okay, yeah, I can definitely tell we're heading back to the farm. A lot more lag going this way. I definitely need to get to the bottom of that. Definitely. Yeah, now that we're not facing the farm, now it's perfectly fine. And unfortunately, the logs aren't helping me much either. It doesn't really say anything about uh, any particular mod that's having troubles, so... Oh, crap. Yeah, do not run into them road markers. Those are bad. Oh, look out. Oh, crap. That's a wall. That's what happens when you're uh, trying to look at your map. Same time you're driving. And what I'm thinking I'll do here, I'm going to create a course play course for this. Definitely have to do a lot better job of driving, though. I want uh, course play wandering all over the road like I'm doing. Eh, yeah, got to get uh, things interesting. Uh, what's he at? 63%. Okay, so we're going to have to get something up there fairly quick. 
was hoping maybe I could get the uh, sunflower sold before that would happen, but doesn't look like that's going to be the case. Doesn't help the mill is like far away. Come to think of this. Uh, no, I guess we do not own that field. I say, I see there's a buy icon floating there, so I'm assuming that means we do not own this field. Oh well, there goes my excuse for driving across it. Crazy truck, sheesh. This thing really turns slow sometimes. Okay, and I think before we make another trip, we'll pull it up in the garage, get it fixed up. Who left a bucket laying there? Oh yeah, there's a potato planter in there. Okay. Let's get that out of there a minute. I didn't get repaired, did it? Yeah, I'm not sure what caused all the damage on this potato planter, but happened to notice like, wow, 71%? Really? Oh, okay, there we go. That'll do. I uh, can't really pull it up here because that's in the way. Oh, well. I think we'll just wait till that's uh, fixed then. And I think we'll... Uh, Probably a good place to call it an episode then. So yeah, if folks have any comments or questions, uh, be sure to leave them below. And as always, thanks for watching, and until next time.